Hello everyone! Welcome back to Let's Interactively Play The Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind with me, Variax. This time, the suggestion comes from a user called Farolith, who gave me two choices. Either go along a little like sight suri uh, type uh, sight seeing tour type thing of the uh, Sea of Ghosts, or artifact exploring. And because I don't, I can't possibly decide for myself, I randomly chose one of those. And we're going to go artifact exploring. Uh, and we're going to be like the um, mortal Variax. Not the vampire Variax, but the mortal vam um, Variax. Because this will involve travelling around. Because I need some equipment and some spells for this. I am not going to tell you what we're going for, but I have to find a artifact uh, that I'm aware of within the game. Um, it could be in some dungeon somewhere and just show it to you. So that's what I'm going to do. Role playing kind of goes out the window for this one because how would Variax know where it is? It's like, oh yeah, that uh, that that thing um, I, I that I that I used to have. I, I dropped it in that cave, didn't I? I'd best go get it back. Yeah. So this is um, what I'm going to get. Once belonged to Variax, but he um, he lost it. Um, sort of a drunken, you know, stag night out or something. Uh, and now he's he's going to go on decide if you can you know see if you can get it back yeah that's the uh, the role-playing thing for you done right yeah um, okay we're I'm not gonna tell you what we're gonna go after but I will be needing some opening lock spells at least one I think I think the thing I want is in a um, level 80 spell, um, 80 level lock, so I need a spell to open that. So we're going to head to um, somewhere with a mage's guild, which is probably going to be Alderun. See if we can find some lock splinter um, or splitter scrolls, because they open um, lock strength 100, so they'll be very useful. Uh, failing that, we'll just make make an open spell with strength 100 on it and hopefully be able to uh, open stuff with that without too much reloading because it will have to reload to do it but there should be like um, a chest here so I should be able to get some more of these which will be very useful and I'll take that um, not that but that as well I might also need to clear some inventory because there's a lot of stuff in this place that I'm going. Uh, the reason I'm doing the one I've chosen is because it's one of my favourites. and I, It's a weapon and I think it's the best weapon in the game that I'm going to get. Let's go and see if we can get a spell. A scroll even. So we want... We want lock splinter. That's what we want. She sometimes has them. But maybe not this time. No. Doesn't look like it. Looks like we're going to be unlucky for that one. That's a shame. Um, okay, goodbye. Someone around here should be able to make me a spell, but I'm going to check the other guilds first. This might be quite a long update. Depending on uh, several factors. Let's go to Balmora. I don't especially want to go to every single guild, <coughs> excuse me, um, looking for scrolls. So if it's not here, I'm just going to make a uh, make an ultimate opening spell. Soul trap. Nope. I don't think it's going to be. It's quite a rare scroll. I think, I'm not totally sure to be honest, but I think that um, scrolls are kind of random in their inventories. I don't know if they change throughout the game or whether they're sort of um, generated at the start of it, but I'm sure I've seen a lock splinter spell um, at Aldrun once, but maybe it depends on your level as well. Alright, spell making. I want an open spell. I want it on touch and it's going to be 100. Spell chance 8. That might 
increase to 16 because my fatigue's down at the moment. We're going to call it Skeleton Key. Bye. Also, I'm going to make one that has strength 80, which I believe is what I need. Let's see if that's um, any better. So that's, st yeah, strength 20, so I mean, chance 20, so. Uh, we're going to call that Skeleton Key Miner, I guess. Right. Uh, this seems like a good place to dump some stuff as well, so I'm going to leave some uh, heavy items lying around. Very valuable items as well. One of them. Uh, what else can I drop? I very, very, really use that Daedric Tanto anyway, but I have a lot of potions. And they're worth. Yeah, I'll drop them as well. Um. Not a lot else I can drop, really. I've got about 150 spare uh, inventory, so... That should be okay. Right, you, do, you guys don't touch these. These are mine, okay? I'm a member of this guild. I have done no quests, not helped you in any way, apart from giving you gold for your services. Um, but yeah, just leave these alone. These are mine. In fact, this is my room, and these four beds, these are mine, so... Just leave it. Right, now we're going to head to Sadrith Mora. Those of you who were... Uh, some of you might have cottoned on of, of to what we're um, getting here. I don't know which of these sell scrolls. I'll just have a look. It's you, okay. You're going to have one, aren't you? You're going to have one. Soul Trap. No, I don't think I'm high enough level them to appear yet. But that's fine. Goodbye. I think I'll be okay doing this. I think I will. I always find a way to uh, beat the enemies. Yes? Yes. Actually, spells... Do you have divine intervention? How can you not have divine intervention? Do you have divine intervention? Yes. Thank you. Yeah. Save. I need divine intervention. Right. This is the first time we've been here in this LP. The Televani place. Or one of them anyway. Because they live in giant mushrooms. Ah! Oh. Right, and what we uh, need to do is head that way and find a cave. No, not this way. This way. Oh, come on. Get. No. no. Uh. Yeah, this way. We need to find a cave. Which will probably be the hardest part of this LP. Because uh, I'm not quite sure where it is. I always have like difficulty finding this cave. It's um, a bit bothersome. We have some Daedric ruins here. And if you look around them, you will find that there is no entrance to this Daedric ruin. You cannot find a way in. Which is most odd, because, you know, all Daedric Ruins have uh, entrances, but this one does not. That's because you can only access the uh, ruin via this cave. I'm, I'm assuming that uh, where I'm going is under this ruin. It does kind of make sense. Right. Let's try and find this cave. It's on one of these islands. What a lovely night. 
The Sky and Morrowind's just gorgeous. They really just outdid themselves on the Sky and Morrowind. Probably about the prettiest uh, thing in the game. I mean, even by today's standards. And uh, I kind of dislike that uh, expression, but it's, yeah, very nice. Right, so it could just be here. In fact, this is looking quite hopeful. There should be a skeleton guarding it. A skeleton which skeleton which has a habit of killing me. Yeah, I'm in the right place for once. Wow, that was easy.